How's it going, everybody? This has got to transform more. I have to play something fun. I have a mystery box. It's really more like a mystery hanging box thing. Like it's 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 a little different from the older mystery boxes I've opened in the past, at least. Uh, picked this up from a local Walmart. Uh, it has been a long time since I've been able to find, let alone open one of these. Uh, but mystery box, there's three random packs and an online code card inside of this. There's randomly inserted vintage packs. It says one in 10. I personally don't believe that's true, but either way, there's a chance to get something really nice. Uh, either way, there's three packs and a code card. Uh, does it, it's could be anything like could even be something that isn't pictured basically. I think that's more or less what it says down there at the bottom. I'm not I'm not going to focus on that. <laughs> uh, basically, we're going to get three packs. Hopefully we can get something nice from one of them. Uh, but I want to talk about the background first. We got Sharkon and Bulbasaur as always. Uh, this guy right here is Devastator. He is a devastating figure <laughs> in that he has so many pieces that just keep falling apart. It's a miracle I got him into this room without something else popping off. Uh, I literally had to put him back together because half of him fell off the table and behind the bookcase he was on and just, yeah, he's a kind of a nightmare to get all back together, but I got him there. He's fine. He's good. He's here. Good. Uh, but yeah, and I got the mystery box. Let's see. Is there... A tear tab. I don't like how it's wrapped, I can say that. <laughs> okay. Let's see. So we have. So that, that's everything there. Got our code card, which we'll show in a second. We have two Darkness of Blaze and a Chilling Rain. I'm perfectly fine with that. Uh, upon opening that, I was a little worried because it did kind of seem like it might have been tampered with, but as long as everything is in there that's supposed to be in there, I'm fine with all that. Uh, like we got the three packs and the code card, which... Looks like it's a single strike Urshifu premium collection box. So I almost never give these things out because uh, I usually keep them to get the promos myself. But this is definitely a product I've opened already, more than likely. Either way, someone else can have it that time. There you go. Uh, but we'll start with the packs, oldest to newest, starting with the two Darkness of Blaze packs. And then hopefully we can get at least a hollow or something between the packs. Uh, there's a code, there you go, four and two, because of the card I do not name, we have Galarian Darumaka, Carablast, Ducklet, Jigglybuff, Trapinch, Steeny, Rose Tower, and Familiar Bell, Reverse, Phoebus, Phoebas, uh, common reverse hollow. Let's see, darkness of blaze. That is actually a reverse hollow I still needed. So, if nothing else, we got a new reverse hollow from this. I'm happy with that. Uh, the rare is a Golurk. Non hollow. Definitely happy with the reverse hollow though. Uh, second pack, Charizard's on there. As awesome as it would be. As awesome as it would be to get a Charizard, I would rather get a new card. I do have uh, the VMAX, at least from this set, already. We have a Galarian Mr. Mime, Fletchling, Electric, Pansage, Skarmory, Dedene, Dartrix, and Clang. Reverse. Ooh, Dracovish. Am I still missing this as, like, part of the normal set? 
I am still missing this as part of the normal set. Like, this is a hollow rare, isn't it? I'm still missing the hollow uh, for this card. I don't, I don't, I don't, let me see if I'm missing the reverse hollow, too. Top 53. That is also there on the list. Funny enough, it goes Phoebus and then Dracovish on the list. So we got Boom Boom 1 2 on the list. Very nice. That might honestly be the first time I'm even seeing this artwork. Because <laughs> I have not seen, I have not personally seen this card yet. Because I don't have the hollow still. And this is the first of the reverse I've gotten. So nice there. Uh, very, like, amazing to me that I can go this long having just never pulled a version of that card, I guess. And maybe having never even seen it yet. Like, I generally can't remember having seen it before. <laughs> uh, but anyway, the actual rare is a Drake Azult, not the Drake of Ish. Uh, but that is a non holo and it is one I have already. Now we got Chilling Rain for the third pack. And I will give out that code. There you go. Got four and two. There we go. All right. Final pack. We have a Shuppet, Squivet, Diglett, Swirlix, Lapras. Ooh, almost skipped Kakuna, Karen's Conviction, and Single Strike Scroll of Piercing. Reverse. Galarian Weezing. A nice rare reverse hollow there, 96. I'll be surprised if I'm missing this. And I am not. It is a duplicate. But it is a rare reverse as well, so we'll count it as a pull. Uh, the actual rare. boy. <laughs> Talk about unexpected pulls from a mystery box of all things. <laughs> that is the Galarian Articuno alt art. That is a nice looking card. I do not believe I have this yet. I'll double check to be sure, but I would remember pulling this, I think. <laughs> 170. Yeah, that is on the list. Uh, so that is a brand new pull. I, I thought the reverse hollows made this box worth it, at least. But that, that sealed the deal, to say the least. <laughs> so three packs. Uh, the funny thing, I had that worry that this might have been tampered with. Because, <laughs> like, 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 upon opening it or trying to get the plastic off, I realized one of the sides was kind of poked in. Like, someone had at least maybe tried to look into it. Uh, but, yeah, if they, they didn't see what was inside, I guess. <laughs> uh, we got uh, one rare reverse hollow with Galarian Weezing. Uh, two new reverses, one of which being a rare here. We got Dracovish and Phoebus. Uh, but the best pull, Galarian Articuno V, Alt Heart. I was not expecting that from this at all. Like, the last thing I expected wasn't, like, one of the last things I expected. It was just, like, a high-end rarity something or other. <laughs> from just a mystery box of all things. But yeah, I mean that that's honestly like my like my take on all these repackaged products. I don't believe for a second like the MJ Holden Company or Fairfield or whatever else makes this this stuff. I don't believe they tamper with or weigh or put in bad stuff intentionally. Because stuff like this does happen. But it is possible they buy from someone that does. You know what I mean? Like, I don't believe they probably check who's, like, who's selling it to them or who they're buying from. 
uh, whether or not they're reputable or, I mean, sometimes they might just be like t opening up product and just repackaging them in this stuff. Like the, these might have come from like, these might have come from the single strike Urshifu food collection box. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, this is why I buy this stuff because sometimes you do get really lucky with something. Uh, in this case, it wasn't the something I was hoping for because when I opened the box, I was hoping for a vintage pack. Uh, but I'm still very, very happy with that pull. Uh, but yeah, I don't think... I mean, if I, if I ever did find more, I'd probably pick up another one, but I go to Walmart so rarely that it's not likely I will find another one. <laughs> so I, like, finding this one was more I ended up going to a bunch of Walmarts and happened to get lucky at one. Uh, but yeah, I think otherwise that's it for this opening. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more, of course. Uh, I have to say, I don't know when all these videos are going up. I'm recording a bunch and deciding afterwards kind of when they go up. Uh, I'm probably back at work, which stinks, which this might be my last video in a row. Uh, let me go back to whenever I'm able to upload. Uh, we'll have to see. I know as of recording this, I still have plenty of time to do some recording, so might keep the train going of daily uploads a little bit longer. We'll have to see. Uh, in the meantime, thank you all so much for watching. Stay tuned for more. Have a great day.